Well, good morning, guys. We are on an adventure today. We're adding to our little family, and we're picking up a few rabbits. Um, driving to the guy's home now, just outside of the main city. So, it's a couple of hours away, we say. So, we'll see you soon. It'll be worth the drive. Get some extra animals for our farmstead, homestead, right? Yes, yes. The All right, guys. Exciting day. We'll see you soon. Very exciting. See you when we get there. Sure, that's fine. Yeah. Whatever you want, whatever you think. Yeah, because we only have two cages. So okay. Think, so. And the does are fine together for a while. In a way, with rabbits, I don't know if you guys have ever had rabbits. Right. Uh, yeah, in the past for oh, a short no. while. Yeah. You know, you know, bucks pretty much on their own. Yeah. And then, when you want to mate, bring the bring, bring the, the doe to over. the boat. Yep. So. Yeah. Like I yeah. said, so these have kind of been communal. Okay. You know, living together, so they they all deal. You know, they're fine together. Yeah, we were thinking of doing more of a colony for the females yep. and then just, you know, when it was time, just yep. bring them over to visit for a little while. Yep. Yep. Yeah, it doesn't thing take long. On. <laughs> yeah, let them get their thing on. So, we got the bunnies. They're so adorable. The girls are about nine months old and the boy is just over a year. So, it's fantastic. Got them from a nice family and, um, the daughter's name was Madeline, adorable, and uh, it's nice, it's great, exciting. You know, she's already named the does, so the does will keep the names. The white one is Marshmallow, the brown one is S'mores, and the gray one is Stormy. So we have our three girls, and then the boy, well, we're just going to call him Buck, you know. So we're excited, <laughs> yes. There you go. It's going to be wonderful, wonderful. Bucking Buck. Bucking Buck, yes. Wonderful addition to our farm family. So excited, so excited. Can't wait to get them home and get the cages built so we can have them ready to go. Oh, here we go. Here, here comes Buck. Here comes Buck. Number one. Well, Bucky. here's here's Bucky in his little bachelor pad. Just gonna hang out in there till we finish building the cage. Hey, Buck. Now we're going to get Marshmallow, S'mores, and Stormy. Those are the names the cute little girl gave them. Ooh. Careful with the stairs, babe. Careful if those stairs are slippery. And these are the girls. The white one is named Marshmallow. The brown one with the white stripe down her nose and the little gray markings is S'mores. And then the gray one, her name is Stormy. Stormy, Stormy Daniels. Stormy, Stormy Daniels. <laughs> yeah. I'm so excited. I'm so so excited. now we have to build uh, a hutch for them, a home for them because they don't have one. And particularly the boy is in, you saw in that little tiny box there. Yeah. And that's not ideal. So I need to do something. It's freezing, it's 25 degrees and probably less than that right now because the sun is setting. But, anyways, uh, it, it took most of our day to do this drive and go uh, to past, past Roanoke, Roanoke. Yeah. Virginia, and we, you know, uh, we, we, we found the rabbits, but it, it was worth it. For $10 a rabbit, guys, you can't beat that. 
Yeah. So and for forty dollars, we got four rabbits. It wasn't a rabbit mill, and you know the conditions they were living in were quite clean. The gentleman was very nice. So what we're thinking is maybe uh, take advantage of this old barn here, guys, and build a hutch. Uh, in the corner all the way back there which is closest to that door that goes to the house so we can just walk right here and take care of the uh, rabbits right yes. honey yes so and we have a whole corner there so and then they have already like like a roof there's some plywood all plywood up there that uh, maybe we could use but uh, I have some um, scraps of wood and boards that I found here then some of them are just like I don't know over two inches thick so uh, they're very very thick boards and rough cut lumber I love it it's the best I know a lot of you will agree yeah this is so this much side, easier to walk through here it's this, level this side would be the chicken coop yeah here can be their way to come out into so we can have the chickens in here too yeah, everything and then, then right. we could do um, here fencing from the wall to the tree to the tree to the wall and they'll be fenced in you know, just right. in this area, they'll be outside. They'll have the nuts and the bugs from the trees. Right. Yeah. It's a lot and of glass then, here. We got to be careful yeah. with him. And then we go inside. Yeah. The chickens could go inside. Right. And then when I go in to check the Yeah, rabbit, do a run back here. Yeah, from here. Mm -hmm. And then right here, we've already got the corroded wood. It's open. So we just open that up right there. Just that's a great idea, honey. Great idea. I that's like what, that. That's what I yeah, was thinking. I think so. I'm freezing. Yeah, I'm freezing. I don't know how long I can stand it. We got a little tiny pine there. We're gonna let it grow. Yep. Billy, don't you dare pee on and then, it. Yeah, and then we can come here and this will be where our, where our orchard is. Yeah, well, we want to build a little cabin and I want to do it in this corner right in here. It's pretty much level all in through here. It's a pretty nice area, nice space. And uh -huh. it faces the sun. Yeah, you can get the And it goes and all day long like this. And then the cabin, our cabin is back there in the corner. If the camera is shaking, guys, I'm sorry, but I'm shaking and uh it's not the camera's fault so i'm totally shaking and but there it is uh so it's far enough and it's away enough Problem. and so this is perfect i'd love to do put one right here right okay. here you see the sticks are already marking yeah we have the markers pretty much down already where we want to put them right so and then yeah it's perfect it's right in between, you know, you get to enjoy the animals, you get to enjoy the garden oh, in front of you. Yeah. And then eventually we'll have the fence blocking um, the neighbor's yard and we can grow some vines or big bushes, evergreens, like maybe boxwood or something. Yeah. Underneath, something that could grow in the shade under the pines. Yeah, I could really start to hear you because yeah, you were talking inside your sweater. <laughs> it's so cold. Okay, okay, he was, he was oh, going, he was rolling again. Now, it's, you see, he, every time I go to film him, yeah, he well, stops. We just have to pretend that we're not watching him and then that goes Okay. Back here. Crazy maniac. The wild dog. But yeah, this, I mean, if we clean up. Yeah, and then we got all, all this wood all back here. here. So we, we got, you know, we yeah, open it we up a little bit. Support. You know, leave some of the bigger trees, yeah. of course, but get rid of, yeah. you know, space them This out. is a deer trail right here. Yeah. They walk right from back here. And they go to get the water. To the road, cross the road, and go to the other side of the woods back there. So, so yeah, this is a like clear trail. The yeah. They go down to, to the water to our creek to drink. Oh, okay, well, I think I'm, I'm going to head back now. Okay. Uh, <laughs> enough. <laughs> I'm going to pick this way. I'm going to go this way. But yeah, real quick, uh, this is all pretty nice and level in through here for the most part. And yeah, we're closer to the road, but that's fine. We can use all of this. And then um, all in through here, it's really nice. So we got plenty of room. Yeah, there's almost, it's almost like a driveway. Yeah, right. Like an additional driveway. Yeah. But our main focus right now, our main, what are you doing, you coming? Yeah. <laughs> Our main focus right now is to get uh, everything that we need to start our garden for this summer because we want to get a, an early start and we're going to see if we can start growing some seeds indoors in February, starting February, because um, and then we'll see if we can get a little greenhouse built, I don't know, we'll see, but we can use our uh, new addition here of the four season room 
once it's all enclosed, uh, we could probably start seedlings, put a heater. I don't know. We'll see. But uh, just thoughts, guys. Just thoughts. Just thoughts. We're going to go in. It's freezing. Take your own thoughts. <laughs> <sighs> Love you all. Thank you all for watching. God bless. Peace, love, and happiness. Ciao. Bye.